so I don't really know what to call this. This video, I don't know if it's my like most embarrassing moment, my most awkward moment, but it's it was fucking all of it combined. It was shit. It was a shitty experience. So let's just call it that. Anytime I think of a, something that happened in boot camp or a story or whatever, this is the first one that always pops up into my mind. And the funny thing is it happened the first day of boot camp. So it kind of set the tone for me, a real shitty tone. It wasn't a good starting, it wasn't a good first day. But uh, let me tell you what, let me tell you this fucking story. Uh, it sucked, man. It fucking sucked. So it was the first day of boot camp. It was the first night. I had just gotten off the bus, right? We got there. They're like, get in line, all the recruits, blah, blah, blah. So we have all our belongings that we don't need. We give it to the RDCs. They mail all our shit back. And then we do our phone call, right? We call our parents, uh, tell them that we got there safe, whatever. After that, we have to do a piss test. We had to do a, a drug test, right? To make sure everybody's clean before you start boot camp. Make sure you don't pop. So now for me, I had never really had to pee in front of somebody before. And I didn't even know this was an issue that I had because I just never, I was young, I was 18. I never had to do a drug, you know, besides the one that you have to do for your recruiter. That was, I took that one on my own though in the bathroom. I never had somebody watching me, watching my dingling. So we had to do the piss test. So they got everybody in a classroom, all 70 of us in this big room and, um, Actually, they had us take our test first, our, our test to see if we advance. They had us take that test first in this big-ass classroom. And then after we were all done, they were like, all right, it's, we're going to do your drug test now. So they did everybody alphabetically, right? Or like in groups, like 10 people would go at a time. 10 people would go into the bathroom. And they would have an RDC there to watch everybody pee. So I was like, maybe the second group, I go in there. RDC's watching us. I'm like sitting there. I'm standing there. I'm trying to go. He, my, my guy's out. I'm like, pee. Motherfucker, pee. I'm like, why won't you pee? I was the last one there standing at the fucking stall. RDC is like watching me. I can't pee. I'm looking at him. I'm like, what the fuck do I do? I'm like, my first day of boot camp. I can't pee. I'm like, fuck. So he was like, all right, recruit. Go back to the classroom. Go drink some water and go walk around. So what they had you do if you can't pee the first time, you have to go back into that classroom. They had a drinking fountain. So you drink some water and you just walk around the room in circles. Walk around the whole room while everybody's just sitting down waiting. So I'm walking, I'm drinking, I'm walking. The second group goes. The third group goes. The fourth group goes. I still can't, I still don't have to pee. I'm like, what the heck? This is crazy. I'm still drinking water. I'm still drinking water. Finally, after everybody went, there was maybe like four or five of us out of 70, out of my whole division that couldn't fucking pee. So I'm like, you're fucking kidding me. Of course it's me. Of course I'm probably going to be the last motherfucker and everybody's going to wait on me and everybody's going to get pissed because I can't pee. I don't know what the hell's wrong. So of course, I'm literally the last person. I can't pee. Everybody's waiting for me as I'm walking around the room looking like a fucking idiot Drinking water, drinking water, I still can't pee. Finally, everybody leaves. Everybody goes on and to the next station, right? Probably, I think the part after the piss test is when you go get like all your clothes and your skivvies and your shoes and all that shit. So anyways, I'm still in that room walking around in circles trying to pee. I'm finally like, all right, I think I can do it. I tell the RDC, I think I can pee. I go into the bathroom. I have to go so bad. Literally, my bladder hurts. Like it's hurting, I have to go so fucking bad. And I go there, whip it out, he's watching me like a fucking hawk, and I still couldn't fucking pee. I still couldn't go. And it was crazy. And I think eventually, maybe like 20, 30 minutes after that, I was like, all right, I have to go now, I have to go pee. So uh, he comes in, the RDC comes in, I'm like way behind, everybody's already on to the next station, and I finally fucking peed you know I just had to go so bad my body was like whatever's wrong mentally with you I'm gonna pee and I literally it was like three minutes I was going like three minutes it was the longest piss of my life but yeah I finally did it knocked that shit out 
But I don't know, for me, uh, if you have like, I, I think it has to do with like anxiety or some issues that, whatever issues that I have, regardless, I was like totally fucking surprised. It fucking sucked. It set a negative tone for me. Things got a little better after that. And But ever since then, ever since I've had to do a piss test, even if it's like just for medical reasons, I, I can't, it takes me forever to be able to, to be able to go. I think I'm like traumatized, but that's the most, that's my most embarrassing. It was just humiliating, you know, not humiliating. It was just embarrassing. Like I have to go, I had to go in there three times and I couldn't go both times as he's watching me. I'm just standing there, not peeing. And then you had to walk around. I had to walk around the whole room as everybody's waiting for me to go. I don't, I don't know what's going on here, people. I'm trying. It's not working. But that was my, that was my probably most embarrassing moment in boot camp. I have some other boot camp stories that I'll probably share with you in the future. That one has just always stood out to me. Um, but yeah, don't. It's nothing to worry about. Just like you know, just make sure you don't go to the bathroom in the airport. Uh, when you land in Chicago, hold that shit in because you're going to have to do a drug test when you get there. So, yeah, that's my story. Um, my social media, I just got a Snapchat. All that shit is below. Uh, and, yes, I hope you guys are liking the videos. Um, and... And yes, I will see you later on in the week. I'm trying to do two to three videos, two to three videos a week, I'm trying to stay consistent. Um, and yeah, that's all I got today. I will see you guys later. All right.